Guys, the best thing I can tell you is that why this location would be great is because it's super close to the main traffic circle. So if you're trying to get in and out of Anacortes, um, like get to the highway to go to Whidbey, you will love it. The downside is this is a busy road. Um, the house is super charming. I met the homeowner. I love her. She said since they've purchased it, they've owned it about 11 years. They replaced all the doors and windows, um, the flooring. It is uh, a cozy living area. Um, there is popcorn ceilings. Similar to the last house, it's just kind of the standard ceiling height, which I think is seven, six, or eight foot. Don't hold me to that. Um, they have big furniture in here. And I think if you had you know, a sectional, you could go this way. That's a giant TV. That's probably the logical spot for a TV. But if we had a sectional going you know, like this, I think this wall could be a good uh, TV wall. There's a lot of natural light. Um, it's a cozy dining space, but it certainly could have a centered table. Um, they have updated the kitchen counters in here, appliances and the sink. Um, there is a nice yard that circles that direction and is fully fenced. Um, the cabinets are certainly original, and but they are real wood um, painted. Here's the laundry room, and you've got your furnace in here, and the washer and dryer, and the water heater. And these all look um, new-ish and in good condition. Okay. So probably the only drawback really is the uh, road noise. With this door closed, you wouldn't hear a darn thing. So even the interior doors have been replaced. Trim around the doors. So we have a coat closet here. Um, probably a little linen closet here. And then um, come to bedroom one that they use as an office. Certainly a big enough bedroom to have a queen size bed. You could use that as a headboard wall. If you had a smaller bed, this could be a headboard wall. This wall here would hold a larger um, chest of drawers. Closet doors are not on the, um, the closets, but the tracks are there, so you could reinstall those if you wish. The um, hallway bath is the bath, so there's a big vanity, single commode. Um, newer tub and then pretty uh, tile surround. Very, very uh, lightly used house. And then we have the last two bedrooms. In here they have a full, easily a queen could fit on that wall, you know, so that you can see what type of furniture they have. Here's uh, the wardrobe closet again. Um, you know, those could be painted. Those doors could be replaced, of course. And then they have a king in their uh, primary. And it takes up a lot of space, but it fits. And then they have a wardrobe closet there. Um, because of the road, I'm not gonna, you know, do tons of video. Um, if it was a road that you didn't mind, I would tell you that uh, this would definitely be worth exploring. Um, she's out in the garage, so I'm going to switch places with her. Hello. <laughs> places? Yes. Come on, Mr. E. <laughs> oh, my goodness. I want to hug him. Okay. Easy step down into the garage. It is a long single car garage. So if you had two um, Mini Coopers, you could p park tandem. That's how long it is. And uh, they have a big freezer in here. Scuttle access to the attic space and then the panel at the end. Um, I believe they did park in here up until the point when they, oh, there's the, the missing doors, um, up until the time that they decided to move and they put some of the things for downsizing here. And it's like an, an original panel. Oh, they've got that. Um, there's little locks on it, so I'm not going to try. And then a uh, side, side door here. So the big news would be the road noise, um, road activity. Outside of that, super cute. Uh, the homeowner is just absolutely precious. 
Um, they are leaving the area, going back to where they came from, which is Florida, and they were military. And so um, that tells you about the military. Um, and they love the area. They love the access point, And they said their neighbors are all fantastic. <laughs>